All right, y'all. Bitcoin. We need to talk about Bitcoin right now and ask the question, is this move the real deal or is this a trap? Is this a bull trap? We are going to talk about it. But first, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy technical analysis updates, as well as trading strategies and other stuff like that, guys. Make sure to like the video, subscribe, all that good stuff. All right, so earlier today, Bitcoin got a massive pump actually coming down to this key level right here. And then we really got the breakout when we broke out of this trend line that we were kind of forming right here. We kind of had this little channel that finally broke out. And now we see that we are finding some resistance at a key level of resistance. Now, I actually did take a long trade from down here. This is one of the setups we gave in the VIP Discord in advance right here. You can see we were eyeing up this golden pocket if we got bullish divergences on Market Cipher B. And you can see here on Market Cipher B, the reason we got such a big pump is because as we were coming to this key level, and by the way, this was not just any level, this was actually a Fibonacci golden pocket retracement. If we take the Fib tool from the swing low here to the swing high, we can see that we're coming right down to that Fibonacci golden pocket level. And so we did take a long right from there. And we're currently getting some resistance. Now, what is this resistance? This is this previous high right here that we put in where we had this zone of consolidation right here where we are currently rejecting. And this also, I did give the heads up in the VIP Discord as we were coming to that level that uh, we were rejecting from it. And now we've gotten a significant move to the downside. So the trades that I have taken so far just based on the pump to the upside and the short from the downside are pretty juicy, right? Pretty juicy. This one's up right now, pretty high leverage. Uh, this one's up about 45% right now. So the question on everyone's mind, oh, and by the way, if you do wanna get into the VIP Discord, where we post these trade setups in advance, where we also have a thriving community of traders who are posting the juiciest technical analysis, as well as the juiciest levels, trading updates, trading setups, you can go to patreon.com forward slash Jason Casper. But we really need to ask ourselves the question, what is going to happen from here with Bitcoin? Well, I think we need to go to a higher term time frame in order to determine what exactly is going to happen. And so if we go to maybe a daily time frame and we just zoom out here, I want to point out a few things that are very, very, very significant. First of all, we are getting an anchor wave and a trigger wave on market cipher B on the daily time frame. This is very, very bullish. This is very rare. This does not happen very often where we get anchor waves and trigger waves as price continues to make lower highs during a phase of consolidation. This is very, very rare. Now, currently you can see we're finding some local resistance right here coming up into this previous high. But I want to point out the fact that the very important level that we need to come above if we want to see a true breakout is going to be this 44.4 to 44.8 level. And the reason why that's such an important level is because this will be officially a higher high on the daily time frame. If I just kind of turn all these things off so we can see more clearly, we can see that we have been in a downtrend since the 10th of November. If I go back in time here and make market cipher a little bit smaller, we can see that from November the 10th day, we have been putting in uh, the high, then we put in the low, the lower high, the lower low, the lower high, the lower low, the lower high, the lower low. We put in a lower high. Now we put in a higher low. This is really the determining factor. If are we gonna have a trend reversal? Because if we put in that higher high, on the daily time frame, this will then be a giant W pattern here, which is a reversal pattern, okay? And I think we could come back up to around this area right here. But it's very important that we come above that area. Not only is that a higher high, it's also a local Fibonacci golden pocket retracement. So right now for me, yes, we're having resistance right here. Yes, I am sure from here. But the level I am mostly looking for is going to be this 44 Point four to forty four point eight level. We have a golden pocket. We also have the previous high. So if we want to really confirm this breakout, we need to put in a higher high on that daily time frame. Now, a few other things that I would like to point out here is that I've been saying it for weeks that I'm getting very bullish, that I am looking for a relief rally, that I am looking for um, an uptrend from this area. And the reason is because 
if we go to the daily time frame, not only do we have these bullish signs on market cipher B, but we are forming some bullish patterns. For example, we are forming this falling wedge right here that we are currently breaking out of. This is very significant, breaking out of the falling wedge. Not only are we breaking out of a bullish pattern, but if we just use our eyes here, we can see that we have a lot of support in this general zone right here. Okay, we can see that this green box right here acted very strongly as resistance back in January 2021. It was resistance again. It was support flipped into resistance, 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 support, support. So I'm saying we come down to a very, very strong area of support. We're seeing bullish signs on market cipher B. It means we should be looking for upside movement right here. This is a bullish pattern at support with bullish signs on market cipher B. This is why I am actually in a swing long position from the wick down here because we were looking to take that long all the way back. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. A while ago now. We've been we've been watching we've been looking for this trade setup for a while right here. Since the 3rd of January, we were looking to come down below 41k and get bullish divergences on market cipher B to enter into a swing long position. Take profit one is officially hit, but that is what we had. We had a lower low with a bullish divergence on market cipher B into that box of support for a swing long position. So I am now holding three long positions here. And my hope is that we are able to come above this key level right here. Okay, this golden pocket, this previous high at about 44.4K. I'm going to draw a line on the chart. Okay, when we zoom out this level right here, 44.4 ish. I'm going to make it a little bit um, higher because that's what we need to be, 44.4. This is very, very important. This will confirm a macro trend reversal. Okay, once we come above the 44.4K uh, level, then the next major area of resistance is going to be, well, there's a few areas, but a major level is going to be the $47,000 level at that high volume node. And then the biggest area of resistance is going to be the Fibonacci golden pocket retracement, which also finds confluence with the high volume node from literally the entire year of 2021, which also finds confluence with the falling wedge and the breakout from the um, top of the wedge to the breakout, we can see we have massive confluence right here. So if this is in fact going to be a real breakout, number one, we need to come above 44.4. Once we do that, we've officially changed market structure. And if we continue to the upside, of course, there are levels we need to be aware of along the way. But the macro target for me is going to be this $57,000 level. And I am actually expecting a rejection and further downside after that, simply because the very high term time frames are looking pretty bearish, right? We go to the two week time frame. What do we see? Bearish divergence. We go to the monthly time frame. What do we see? Bearish divergence. I think there is more downside in the tank here. And we'll just have to kind of wait and see if that happens. And if that does happen, then the target that I am really looking for is going to be the golden pocket from the dump of spring 2021 sorry, spring 2020 to the all time high, bringing our Fibonacci target to around $26,000 to $28,000. So this is kind of my overall swing trading plan for the Bitcoin. Is this a fake out? We're going to have to wait and see. And this is why it's so important to really plan your trades out in advance, because if you are questioning whether or not to get into a trade right here, let me tell you, you have already missed the opportunity to get into a trade. The reason is because you need to learn how to find good entries and not just FOMO in when you see price pumping or FOMO short when you see price dumping. You need to plan things in advance. That is how I am able to get into a long position from right down here and a short position from right up here. It's because we're able to plan these things in advance and think about them and really plan. And then when we see what we want to see, we get into the trade. It makes trading very relaxed. It makes it very easy. In fact, even just yesterday, we took a really nice scalp long from right down here. Let's see. Yeah, from right down here. Um, yeah, this was this was the one. Long in it from 41.6 also. And that, that trade was just massive, right? 
this was right before the breakout. But anyway, the point is, you need to learn how to plan these things in advance. And if you want to learn how to do that, check out jasoncaspertrading.com. This course will give you the knowledge and the skills you need to become a confident, profitable trader because it will teach you how to read the charts and feel confident in your trades. It will teach you how to not FOMO, stop trading with emotions, how to utilize market cipher to get those good trade entries, and also when to buy and sell to maximize your profits. Risk management. Of course, this is not financial advice, paper trading only. But if this is something you're interested in learning, you can check out the testimonials here. There's currently for a limited time, a 40% discount in the description, capital L, capital O, capital V, capital E, love all capitals. That um, for a limited time, I think there's only like eight coupons left, will get you 40% off the course. So that is the update for Bitcoin, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Again, we are breaking out of this falling wedge right here, guys. If we are going to get more of a downtrend, what are we looking for? Personally, for me, I am looking for retracements off these Fibonacci levels, okay? So first of all, the golden pocket is a big one. Second of all, the 382 is also going to be a big level because we can just see our 382 is very, very clear. Um, support, 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 flipped into resistance, resistance. And that is going to be a big level. And then that golden pocket is also a very big level because if we just pull out our volume profile, we can see that we have a high volume node down here. So if we're gonna get more of a retracement, I do believe we're gonna get more movement to the upside here. I'll be looking either for a bounce off 42,589 or a bounce off of the uh, 42K area. All right, that's it guys. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. God bless and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.